educated. All right, apparently the Detroit Pistons are keeping Troy Weaver. Like I said before, Tom Gores either got either he dumb or and I think it's in he just loyal to his people. You know, when you can't separate business from friendship, that's one of the worst things you can do, especially from kinship. You know, uh well, you can't uh when you when you can't separate that, bro, uh it, it ain't it ain't it ain't it ain't it ain't it ain't nothing you can do. It ain't nothing you can do. And look here, man. Hey, this is a, a white man or a Jewish guy or whatever you want to identify as, keeping a black person, giving a black person Troy Weaver every opportunity to keep his job so we can't complain. Can't sit here and say, oh, Tom's a racist and he doesn't like black people. His whole organization is black. From his coaching staff making, you know, Monty Williams one of the highest paid, paid coaches out there. You know what I'm saying? To uh to uh um you know to just paying uh to just paying uh 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 you know, Troy Weaver new contract, which we still don't know the Pacifics on Troy Weaver. We still don't know the Pacifics on Troy Weaver's contract. So, I mean, y'all can say what y'all want to say. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, this this guy, this guy's gave him every opportunity possible. So it says Detroit Pistons GM will remain in place as the franchise begins to search for a new head of basketball operations. So basically, and I got a video talking about how they babysitting them. It's coming. Pause. Uh, but like I continue to say about the situation, man. Um, man, I, I just don't, I mean, yeah, I, I just, I'm, I'm not a fan no more, bro. I love the Pistons. I'm be a Piston fan at heart, but I, I just ain't got no skin in the game. You know, that's just me at this point. I don't have no skin in the game. You know, none. I got no skin in the game. So, yeah, as far as spending money, spending money I buy some merch because I like the piston gear and some of that type of stuff. But uh, but as far as but as far as as far as that, as far as them me going on there financially supporting them, it's just because somebody gave me some tickets. So yeah, it's a rap. It's a rap on that. They don't. They don't get my support. You keep making. You make ignorant moves like this, bro. You know, in reality, everybody should be gone. Look at the track record. Look at the track record. Look at the track record since he got there. He don't care about this team, man. You know, Mister Davidson rolling over in his grave. Mr. Davidson rolling over in his rolling over in his grave right now. And he is. You know, and he is. And he is. And now you're gonna add another chef into into the mix. That's wild. You're gonna add another chef into the kitchen. Come on, man. You're going to add another chef into the kitchen? It's crazy. That is crazy. That is crazy. You know. You know, but, you know. To each his own. To each his own. So the people, you know, B. Teller was asking me, oh, who you think should be the basketball? The, you know, uh, you know, who should be the, the vice president or basketball? Nobody. Any anybody with a with an ounce of dignity, with any, with any credibility, bro. Is not gonna take this job. Listen to me. Anybody 
with any credibility is not going to take this job. You know what I'm saying? Nobody. It's got to be somebody that's starting off who need an opportunity. And even then, I wait for a better opportunity. Or a guy that's been starting off and waiting for an opportunity that feel like the opportunity ain't going to come, so this is the best he can do. Cool. But anybody with any dignity is not about to come into this dumpster fire. And they ain't going to be able to change nothing. Think about this. You got four. You got. You already got three different basketball pins in the building. Listen to me. You got the senior advisor, Aaron Tellerman, Ed Stefanowski, who making moves behind the scenes, right? Then you turn around and you got the front office. No, you know Troy Weaver and his team. Then you got the bass. Then you got the 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 the, the coaches. So you already got three different opinions on what people think about basketball. Now, the only way this semi can work, if Monty Williams is allowed to pick the basketball, the, the, the basketball, the president of basketball operations, whatever they want to call it, that's the only way this shit going to work. That's the only way this can work. And Troy has no power. He's just a figurehead. They just don't want to fire him. They like him, and they're going to make him earn his bread and probably just push paperwork. That's what's doing. They, you know, and of course, you know, as a, as a prideful as a prideful man, he probably do want to quit. But who want to? Who gonna leave this money on the table? And your resume is shitty as they come in the NBA, so you ain't gonna get no other job making this type of money. They gonna have to fire him. What it boil down to? They don't want to pay money to sit at home. Money ain't taking no buyout. They got forced money to take this job. They don't want to pay Troy to sit at home. They just paid Troy Weaver, and all they got to do is dig this 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 this, this uh. They about to dig this franchise deeper and deeper into a hole. Pause. And it's about to get worse. And if you K Cunningham, Jay Ivy, if you any of them, them young brothers, bro, you get the hell up out of here now. At all means necessary, your career is done. You stay. You stay here. Under under these circumstances, your career is done. If you stay here, ring the bell for your basketball career. If you stay in Detroit, if you stay in Detroit right now, you're done. If your agent advised you, what's a couple more million? Fuck that couple extra million you're going to get, man. Get the hell up out of here, man. Get up out of here. It's over with. All you're going to do is, is continue to hurt your stock and value in this situation. That's all you can continue to do is hurt your stock and value in this situation. So it ain't matter who the vice president. You got now. You got four, five, six, seven different chefs in the kitchen. Think they're gonna be successful? Absolutely not. So hey, thumbs up the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel. The subscribe button is the bell icon button. Hit all notifications. Increase the chance of notifications. We go live or drop video. Uh, financially, you wanna you wanna want to support the channel? Cash app dollar sign CJ Good three one three. Venmo CJ Good three one three. PayPal link in the description. Appreciate y'all for supporting the channel. Check out Detroit Piston Talk playlist. Hit the link tree. You want to donate? Support the channel. Best way to donate is to share the video. I appreciate the love support. Let me know what you girls and guys think in the comment section. Peace.